hey guys i know it's been a minute since i um last shot a video it's all right i have been well just a few um issues here and there i'll probably share that in um a longer video but today i just wanna share some good news with you all so let's head over to my computer and take a look at the good news i'm gonna be sharing with you guys i am currently on the government of canada website canada.ca and um this is the good news um the government of canada public policy allowing certain visitors in canada to apply for a work permit covid 19 program delivery and um, you can see right here a temporary public policy has been issued to allow certain temporary residents in canada with a visitor status to apply for a work permit from within canada while all visitors in Canada can apply for an employer-specific work permit under the public policy, only those who held a work permit in the last 12 months may request interim authorization to work. So guys, basically what this means, if you can make it to Canada and you have even just your visitor's visa, then you can apply for an employer-specific work permit. What this means is that you can only work for that particular employer who has sponsored your work permit. So when you get to Canada and you find a job, then you use the um, letter of appointment or from the, the job offer letter from that specific employer to apply for your work permit. So the public policy came into effect on August 24, 2022, and the eligibility criteria were expanded to allow all visitors who are in Canada with valid temporary resident status to apply inland for an employer-specific work permit, regardless of when they arrived in Canada. So this particular public policy is now being extended until February 28, 2023. Initially, the first extension was up to February 28, 2022, but now it's been extended for a further one year. And guys, I'm gonna leave a link at the bottom basically this public policy will permit eligible foreign nationals with valid temporary resident status as visitors to apply for a job offer supported work permit from inside canada exempt eligible foreign nationals from the requirement that a work permit not be issued if they have not complied with certain temporary resident conditions and lastly this public policy will allow eligible former temporary foreign workers to work while a decision on the work permit application is pending. So the eligibility requirements for visitors to apply for an employer-specific work permit, number one, the foreign national is in Canada with valid temporary resident status as a visitor, including status extensions under subsection 1835 of the Immigration and Refugee Protection Regulation that is maintained status at the time of work permit application submission. Number two, has submitted an employer-specific work permit application using the application to change conditions, extend my stay or remain in Canada as a worker. Number three, has remained in Canada with status since application submission. Number four, submitted the application on or before February 28, 2023. If the application is approved, the new status and period of authorized stay will apply. If the application is refused, when status is extended under subsection R1835, the expiry date of the period of authorized stay becomes the decision date on the application submitted. So basically, that's what this guy this says, guys. So if you have your visitor visa or what we call the tourist visa to Canada, technically, if you get a job, in Canada, while in Canada, you are eligible to legally work and um, you will work through by applying for an employer specific work permit, regardless of when you arrived in Canada. Well, guys, that's it for today in terms of the temporary public policy that allows you to get a work permit, employer specific work permit, and work in Canada with your visitor's visa as usual if you found this video helpful please give it a like leave a sweet comment below and share it with all other people that might also find it useful thank you for staying up to the very end of this video i definitely look forward to meeting you on the next one bye guys